I'm at Cafe Milano in Berkeley, and the um, Selcat Benefit digital compilation was released yesterday and went on TV in San Francisco, Channel 76 Cable. I don't know if we can get uh, an archive for that, digitized archives, but I'll try. Um, so, I give a little rundown of all the artists on the compilation and a little interview. And it was also my birth father's birthday, which was interesting. And synchronistically, I got this phone call, uh, somebody asking me if I had sent a balloon bouquet to someone. And it, to me, it sounded like kind of like spam. I was trying to get some information out of her, and I was like, hmm, I don't pick up the phone usually because someone gave my phone number to a spammer so they wouldn't have to give their own phone number to the spammer. But I said, if anything I'm receiving, it would be nice to receive a bouquet with the balloons for, um, you know, for the compilation release, but... I don't know if that's what it is. She wouldn't admit that she was spamming, but I'm thinking about changing my phone number. Um, I have been receiving this woman's phone spam, um, marketing solicitation, whatever you want to call it, for several years. I keep trying to let her know. I keep emailing her because they, they actually give you the address uh, the full, you know, I mean, obviously they can't give you the phone number because they assume it's yours, but they will give you the name and address. So I, I have um, even threatened legal action, but I went to consult and the lawyer said she didn't know how to deal with this type of a case. Um, next thing I can just, you know, I probably should send, send some snail mail, even though it'll most likely get tossed. But um, after that, the only thing I can really think to do <laughs> is to go there in person and, and try to sort of catch her off guard. Um, either that, or I can just direct her in the, um, I can direct her to this video, and see if she'll watch, see if that inspires anything. Somehow I doubt it. I think she's just kind of burying her head in the sand proverbially speaking. So if anyone has any idea of how this may have worked um, for you, if this happened to you or to someone I know, I would be interested in um, any ideas that you may have. And if I have any... Oh, by the way, the Fall did a feature on the compilation. So I will leave the URL in the description. Um, and again, the URL of the actual Bandcamp compilation in case you can purchase a copy to support Selkin. All right. May the divine feline be with you. Meow.